Oh my god! Uh, all right. Well, we didn't rank kicker, punter, and long snapper, but they then we can will. move on. They're to not the real people. <laughs> we're not. We're not even talking about. They're not real people. people. Unless you're Phil Dawson, then you're number one in my heart. <laughs> I promise, not. Phil. They're not real humans. I've been screwed um, by too many kickers. Oh, oh my Blair. god! Dude. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, wait. Were you guys? Were you guys on that? Uh, I was. I was not that oh, good, but I, I got to story. watch it. I, I got to watch okay. it in the spring. For the audience, okay, these sorry. guys both played for the Vikings. I have, I host a Vikings podcast. In 2015, you guys won 11 games. You ho- it, it, Kind of an unexpected, at least from the outside looking in, 11 games, you go in, you're playing. This is the Seahawks in the prime of their Seahawks-ness, right? This is like, that team was stacked. And it was below zero wind chill. Minus outdoor 22. Stadium. Minus outdoor stadium. 22. Yep. And you guys are lining up for a 27-yard game-winning field goal as time is about to expire. And Blair Walsh misses wide, wide left, wide not blocked, and misses wide left. I was what so was I was the I was inactive. Right? I was inactive for that game. Uh, that was my first year in Minnesota. And I was standing next to Rick Spielman because he had come down out of the booth like cause we were all going to celebrate, and <laughs> he missed it. And Rick looks at me, and then he looks back at the field and he just goes what the fuck and then just turned around and walked away and i was just like what just happened right and like it was the classic in the locker room after the game where like zimmer was like hey it's not on blair it's on everyone and i can't remember who it was it might have been everson was in the back and goes the fuck it is it and started like freaking out and like, no, cause like no, seasons, dude. it's like we talked on the last podcast, right? Seasons over. It's over. Like, it's done. And everyone's sitting there and like Zimmer tried to do the, like we lose as a team, we win as a team role. And there was a couple guys that just were not having it. Like they were like, nope, nope. That's fully on three shoulders, right? We will 27 yards player. Like, yeah, it got, it got bad. Like that was probably the worst ending to a season I've had just cause of like, People is there so is there any pissed. sense of like oh we feel a little bad for a guy in that moment or is it just rage? No, immediately Our rage. I think as the like rage. as time healed all wounds type of thing, and I don't even know if it all fully healed. No. Like eventually you're like oh that sucks, but like right there, like immediately after, pure rage because everyone you're was still cold. not pissed. He kicked. He missed like, that kick. Everyone was cold. Like dude, I'm pissed. Joe Berger had frostbite on his hands. Like, people were just so upset because of how miserable the game was. And then to end like that, like, it was it was bad. Were you pissed? Are you still pissed? I mean, I was upset because we, like, I was going to go to Arizona. We were going to go, where were we? We were going to go down to Arizona and play it? the Cardinals, who we'd already beat that year. And then the the Packers, did the Packers beat the Cardinals? That, was no. that the Aaron Rodgers, uh, one of the Hail Mary years? Or was that know. the Carson Palmer? That was, that was the year Aaron Rodgers threw the Hail Mary to beat Detroit. Okay. Yeah, that was yeah. that. Cause but you guys, yeah, you guys had a path. I mean, yeah, because our defense that year was ridiculous. Mm-hmm. Yeah, too bad your kicker sucked. <laughs> God, that I mean, kid, that, kinda, that guy cared more about his arms than anything. He worked out by he was jacked every was jacked. day. Dro- and he but, wore like Hollister. Like I have a couple it best drove friends me that are, nuts. Like I have a couple really good friends that are kickers. Like I'm Brett Maher. Brett Ho- Brett Maher is one of my really really good friends. Right, played together in Nebraska. He lives here in Lincoln, and like talk about feeling bad for a guy. Like I felt bad for Brett Maher. Like now that I was out of it and like watching him and knowing him personally, and like the, how he's battled going to the CFL and to come back and watch a guy get the yips like that. Like I felt bad for Brett Maher last year. Yeah. Alex shows no empathy <laughs> Alex whatsoever. Has zero, zero at empathy. all. All the kickers I played with are done, so I don't feel bad for any of them. <laughs> I remember. I mean, I remember. I was. I, that's the only game in the last 12 years that I haven't hosted a Vikings post-game show of some kind because we had like a – it was like a gopher basketball conflict on our radio station. At the, so I was watching that game with a group of 20 friends. And so – and this is – I grew up in Minnesota. I've watched the Vikings my whole life since the 80s. I have seen crazy missed kicks in big spots, 98 championship game. There's something about a big kick in a game if you're a Vikings fan that you Bad, just you never feel comfortable. And I remember, so the, 20 people are high fiving and celebrating. Oh my god, like the game's over, and I had a feeling go through my body like The Exorcist. And I said out loud, I said, "Oh my god, I think something's gonna happen here." <laughs> like the weather, some like the 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 snaps. I said, "I think something's gonna happen." They're like, "Shut the Mackie, shut the fuck, dude." Shut the fuck. <laughs> I'm like, I, "I'm sorry, I'm sorry." And sure enough, like. Dude, it, that that did, type of stuff is why bad. Vikings fans are probably the most tortured current NFL do fan you, base. Do you remember what we used to do? How we used to mess with Kai Forbath, Cobra Kai. No. So, dude, anytime 
anytime Kai used to come into like the sauna or the like the locker or whatever, we used to mess with him. We used to do the the dodgeball where it was like, oh yeah, like for the like be like Cobra Kai, like oh we used to mess. He hated it. Oh he hated it. It was so fun. Some of them are tough to talk to. I'm not gonna lie to you. Some of them are great though. Some of them are just totally they're weird. They're not like they're they're just weird. Like I was with Steven Hauschka in Buffalo. This dude had an eight foot by like four foot T square, right? That he would like line up and he'd go through like a 55 minute warm up in practice. And then he'd be like, it'd become like end of practice field goal, right? We're all dying. It's a Wednesday. It's like, oh, thank gosh, field goal. And he'd come up and be like, ah, I'm just not feeling it. And we'd all be like, what? What do you mean you're not feeling it? What have you done all day? Right? He's like, I just went through the warm up. Like, I just, I don't feel it. And so you'd be like, okay, field goal on air. And we do field goal period on air. And like then he if he went and missed a kick, we'd all just be like, What are we what is happening? Right? Like, what do you mean? What do you mean? So he would like instead of he lining would up, go through like fifty five yard like fifty five minute warm up. You'd see him on the sideline, he had bands right. everywhere, and then he'd go to coach and be like, I just don't feel it right. I just don't feel it. I, I don't think I have it right now. But shouldn't you but isn't that that that's when you should practice? Because you, you what if you're not it? what if you're not feeling it in the third quarter of a you know Maybe the division fans game? don't know that of a seven day week we only require the kickers four of the days for 30 minutes. Yeah. That's a max. That's a max 30 minutes putting your pads on, Not lacing up it. your shoes, walking out there, taking four snaps, turning around and walking off the field. Dude, I'm not kidding you. If a kicker was like, I'm not in the mood, I would have thrown my helmet at him and beat the shit out of him. Are you out of your mind you're not in the mood to kick a ball? Oh... Jay, you're I'm not. So nice. uh, not really feeling it today. You know, guys, it's just a little cold. I don't yeah. feel the. I don't have the wiggle today. I'm not I got wish it. I, was, I wish I was lying. I wish I was lying. I would have beat his ass. Oh my god! 